Obviously, it was a unique experience for you on Saturday, just getting the targeting call. How do you feel like you handled that? Uh, pretty decent, you know. It's an unfortunate thing, you know. Uh, the guy was running around, you know, all game, so I I figured he was going to stay up that time, and, you know, I, I went low, he went low, and it's unfortunate what happened, but, you know, can't focus on the pass, just got to move forward. What's it like for you just kind of preparing for the week in a game you know you have to miss, you know, the first half? Oh, uh, well, you know, I can't really change my routine, you know. Uh, Either way, you know, I may be missing a half, but I'm also playing a half. So, you know, I still got to take my preparation the same. I can't skip a beat. You know, no matter the circumstances, I still got to maintain my routine. Did you say anything to the guys when you left the field, or did they say anything to you? Uh, yeah, they were telling me, like, you know, don't worry about it. We got you and stuff. But, you know, I was telling them, like, y'all got this. You know, like, don't don't worry about what happened, you know. You just got to focus on the next play. So, you know, those guys, that's, uh, if I'm not mistaken, that's the same. A uh, few plays later, you know, that's when Drake, you know, yep. Drake and Tully, yeah, got that. So I was very hyped for them, you know. So as long as we win one and on the day, I'm happy. Coach Williams kind of called you guys out, started practice. Yeah. How do you feel like you guys responded to that? Oh, uh, good. You know, uh, we came out a little flat. You know, practice can't have that. So, you know, Utah's going to come out here. You know, they're going to try and to give us uh, their best shot. So we have to prepare each and every day at a high, at a high level. Uh, of course, you know, they're going to try and run the ball, you know. Uh, that's always been, you know, Utah's MO is to establish the run. So we have to, you know, come out and make sure that that run does not get established. You kind of had a breakout game against Utah last year. Is this kind of a game you love, you know, those physical teams? Oh, yeah, most up. definitely. You know, uh, Utah, they're going to try and pound the rock. So, you know, we have to meet that and meet that physicality. Everything looked – you guys obviously got the win on Saturday, but was there something you saw on tape that you guys need to shore up and <laughs> – Bye, Drake. <laughs> get fixed for this week? Oh, uh, yeah. The, you know, there's always uh, stuff when you look at the – when you look at the tape, you know, there's always stuff that we need to correct, you know. Too many uh, too many missed tackles out there, you know, uh, too many penalties out there. So, you know, that's stuff that we, uh, we're we looking to clean up moving this week. You guys are one and three in the Coliseum. What, what do you think the issue is just kind of playing in front of the home crowd? And... Uh – I want I want to say really an issue. I would just say you know, one thing that we've emphasized this week is protecting the colleague. You know, uh, Coach Dante has us watching uh, videos and team meeting every day. You know, emphasizing the importance of playing in that stadium because it's something that's bigger than all of us. You know, the greats that have come before us. So really, we have to you know take pride in protecting the colleague. So we're looking forward to uh, displaying that this Saturday. What have you seen out of their quarterback, Cameron? You guys played against him last year, but he got knocked yeah. out early. What have you yeah. seen from him the last couple games? Uh, uh, tremendous quarterback. You know, he can make all the throws. He can uh, extend plays with his legs if need be, you know. And they also have another quarterback, you know, that can, you know, do the same thing. So it's, uh, it's a pretty good matchup. Looking forward to it.